all citizens of the Dominion. On this eve of my last birthday as your queen, let us have one last festivity together. Let's party. Vampire Academy is about the friendship between two young women, Rose and Alyssa. As they enter the adult world, they realize the differences between them in class might be the thing that either tears them apart or makes them change the world together. Have you ever met a royal Maroi in a high position of power with a Dampier best friend? In this dominion, there are three distinct classes. The Maroi, a benevolent mortal vampire. The Dampier are raised to serve the Maroi as guardians. They protect them against the Strigoi, immortal, bloodthirsty vampires. Rose Hathaway is a Dampier. She wants to be the best guardian, yet she questions, why am I doing this? I want to protect my best friend, and I want a life to call my own. Lissa Dragomir is a royal Maroi vampire. She starts off the story really naive. Her life kind of gets flipped upside down. For the next heir to the throne, I name Vasilisa Dragomir. It's all very juicy and very dramatic. I like young love. I like love triangles. I like the star-crossed lovers. There's Lissa and Christian. He's a royal Maroi. Unfortunately, he is an outcast. I heard you spend a lot of time here. Books don't gossip about me. They sort of have this spark. There's a real love there and a real genuine connection. We shouldn't do this. <sighs> Absolutely not. I like the love that was not meant to be. I like the love that tears us apart. And Rose and Dimitri embody all of that. Dimitri is an expert guardian. Their chemistry is real. You need this fight, Rose. I know you're hurting, and I'd do anything to make it stop. One of the great things about this show is that we have all these amazing fights. The stunt team created something beautiful. It's like a dance. You see a lot of precision and skill. They're everything I think everyone wants to see when you're fighting vampires. It's pretty cool getting to do all of the training and the fighting, and it's just nice to see black girls kicking ass and being brave and being beautiful, and I live for that. I live for that. We deserve a better future. Leroy and Dampier alike. Vampire Academy has something very profound to say about equality, gotten across in a fun and entertaining way. Vampire Academy has love and romance. It's got royal yumminess. It tells stories of loss and grief, but it is also the origin story of a revolution. If this is the way the world is, and maybe it's the world that needs to change. And what a thrill to be able to tell that kind of story with two young women at the center. We are all a part of this dominion. My name's Christine Riccio. And I'm Natasha Polis. And we're your hosts for today's Peacock Vampire Academy virtual premiere event. We are super excited to share all the fun things we have planned for today. Natasha and I are both huge readers. We've been Vampire Academy fans forever. My early book talks are just me rambling about Rose Hathaway and pronouncing everything in the books wrong. Did anyone else say to hamper? No. <laughs> <laughs> but that's actually how we first became besties. This is a series we both hold near and dear to our hearts. We are thrilled to kick off and celebrate the new Peacock original Vampire Academy with you guys. We have so much planned for today, from fun Vampire Academy themed games with the cast and showrunners to never before seen footage. But before we start, I think you guys all want to see the cast. We should bring out the cast. Right? Let's meet the cast. Let's meet them. First up, we have Cece Stringer as Rose Hathaway. Woo! Woo! Daniela Nieves as Lissa Dragmere. Kieran Moore as Dmitry Belikov. Andre Day Kim as Christian Ozera. August Richard as Victor Dashkov. Woo! Anita Joy Uwaje as Tatiana Volkel. Woo! Mia McKenna Bruce as Mia Karp. Yeah! Woo! Thank you. Leanne Blondel as Meredith Beckham. Jonetta Kaiser as Sonia Karp. Woo! 
as Mason Ashford. <laughs> we are so excited to oh have you all here. Gosh. How are you guys all feeling? Good. Yeah. Are you all excited at home? <laughs> It's so exciting that we're all here right now. I kind of really want to take a selfie. I think we should do a selfie. Think, yes. Should we do a selfie? Sure. Yes, I have my phone right here. Let's do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do this. <laughs> if we must. Come on. Quality selfie. Thank you. Let's get this show started. Alrighty, y'all, it's time to put your acting skills to the test and see how well you know the Vampire Academy characters. We know you know your own roles, but it's time to see how well you know each other's. <laughs> We're going to play a game of charades. It's time for the Vampire Act Academy. Oh. You'll be assigned a Vampire Academy character at <laughs> random. You need to act out the role without words or sounds for the rest of the cast, and everyone will guess. May the best thespian. <laughs> so our first choice is going to be Anita Joy, Woo! but before she yeah! gets it, yeah! Yeah! make sure that you're guessing in the comments. Yes. Yes. We're gonna go over here. We gotta watch this. This is gonna be some we gotta good watch this. Good. Right. 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 Go do that thing. Let's go. Alright. Okay. Do I hold on to it whilst I so that nobody else gets yeah, it? Yeah, throw it away. Okay. Get 60 seconds. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, 60 seconds <laughs> on the clock. No work. Okay, yep. Ready, go. set, go. Lisa. Lisa. Mia. So no, Me? Yes! Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. 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 Jay, come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, this is hard. No, this you is can't tough. hear me. This is hard. Okay, you ready? Okay. You ready? You ready? Mason. Yep, boom. <laughs> Why don't you take the stage? That was great. Come on, man. Come on, honey. Yeah. You have to be <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, you guys throw it out, out of the basket. Yeah. All right, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Go. Um, Dimitri. Rose. Rose. Me. Rose. That's nice, nice. Okay, woo. Yeah. Woo. Let's see some of them, because I only got birds. <laughs> 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 That's what I actually do, guys. <laughs> wow. <laughs> 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 All right, back. Go, 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 go. All right, Drew, your turn. All right. Woo! 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 Okay. Uh-oh. Here we go. Uh-oh. All right, ready? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 
Uh-oh. Ready? Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Are you sure of that? Yeah. Like, yeah. Yes. Okay. The time is Tatiana. Tatiana. No. Yes, yes, yes. Oh! Yes. I yeah, I, I barely got to yeah. strut. Yeah. Of course, come on now. Okay. Yes. Yes. What is any of us else gonna do if we get to Yeah, yeah. you're screwed. Right. Yeah, it's hard, isn't it? Yes. Right. There's only four names. Oh, okay. Uh, this is a good game. I like this. Why am I so nervous? Very you're good. Come on, come on. Don't you? Very when you're here. Thank you. Her mouth is getting blue. No, girl. Oh, you're the one that's gonna do this. Stop. 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 It's hard, guys. We're losing seconds here. Come on. Oh, okay. Okay, pretend, pretend there's a chair. What? Yeah. Let's go. Yes. 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 I know, I don't know why I did that. <laughs> There's a chair. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right, a point. Woo! 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 Go for it, girl. Let's go, girl. All right. You're that big one. <laughs> okay. Dimitri. Dimitri. I might not be this. I was hoping he was going to go like that. Wow. Yeah, take your shirt off. All right, Kieran. Yeah. All that big talk now. I'm so scared because the couple have no idea what to do. Dimitri. Mia. Meredith. Meredith. Oh. Yeah. That was good. Yeah. That was a good Meredith. That was you. That was me. Shouldn't you be preparing for your reckoning? Chrissy's hair always got really good. Oh my god. 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 Nice work. Y'all, you're too good. You guys are amazing. You guys are such good actors. Oh my god. So good. You guys know each other so well. You're too good for this game. There's a lot of inside game. jokes happening that we were on the outside. We, we didn't get any of them right. Don't be on the inside once they've watched this series. Once yes. they watch. Once yeah. they watch. Yeah. Once yeah. they watch. I was guessing like gondola, Jesus. Like, <laughs> I... <laughs> we didn't know. <laughs> The fun is just getting started up in here. We want y'all at home to celebrate the premiere along with us. Our friends at Peacock have created an Instagram lens filter so you too can walk the blood red carpet. You can find the filter in your Instagram effects library by searching Peacock TV in the effects search engine. The filter lets you strut your stuff on the virtual red carpet and when you make eye contact with the lens, your eyes will glow like the Marais do in the Ooh. show. Don't forget to post it on your story, tag at Peacock TV and hashtag Vampire Academy. We cannot wait to see all of your vampire looks. Yes. <laughs> Actually, we have some special guests we want to introduce, so we're going to make some room for them. I'm so excited to reveal that joining us for this segment are the amazing showrunners of Vampire Academy, Julie Pleck and Marguerite McIntyre. <laughs> next segment was made for Vampire Academy stands. We invited fans of the series to showcase their art on the show today. And you can already see a ton of their gorgeous work here on the stage walls. We'll show our cast a zoomed in image of a piece of fan art and on the monitor, it will slowly zoom out to reveal the full picture. We want you to play along with us, so shout out your guesses of what that art may be before we get to the big reveal. The first fan art piece we have is from at Miss Ascara underscore two. Can you all guess who's in the picture? Ooh. Let's see. Guys, it looks like a Stragoi, possibly. Christian. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, yeah. oh, there it goes. Oh, oh, zooming out. Wow. Oh, it's like a, it's like a, it's a bird. It's my bird. There's the dust. Oh. Oh. There's the duster. Karen, where'd all your hair go? Yep. Holy <laughs> All right, our 
next fan art piece is by at hiccuped underscore studio. Who do you think oh. is featured in this? Right. Okay. Red. 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 Red.
What's that beat too? Not the band well, drum. Behind the stuff. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> what beat you? I think we all went to Barcelona oh. on the same weekend, and yeah. I think we all met up and we had just the best time. And we were filming a bunch, and it was just very hectic and working and working and working. And we saw Barcelona all together, and it was oh, yeah, really that special. Was so, that was really good. Yeah. That's cool. So the next question is for Julie at pink underscore room underscore reads asks, what do you hope new and old fans take away from the show? Oh, gosh. I mean, I hope new fans are like, this is awesome. Yeah. Um, but I think old fans of the books will, I hope, really, um, might take a minute, but hopefully you'll appreciate the way that Marguerite and I took sort of everything that we loved about the entirety of the book series and and worked it into our take and our adaptation of the television series. We're huge fans of the material, and so we wanted to make sure all those great moments found their way into the episodes eventually. Mm -hmm. um, so sometimes it's not like where you think it's going to be, but it's probably in there if it's a moment that you loved. So generally speaking, I hope everybody loves everything. Yeah. <laughs> and Julia, Marguerite, I know you guys have known each other for like 20 plus years. How has that like impacted your collaboration, <laughs> the trust, the like your creative process, all of that? Well, well, I mean, I'm her biggest fan I and have been, you know, for a long time. Like, pre-Shara Forbes days, but dating all the way back to a show we did together called Kyle XY. I think she's one of the most magnificently talented people on this planet, uh, and yeah. certainly, uh, certainly in everything that she does, but also uh, on the page as a writer. So. If Marguerite says she likes something, I'm like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but my favorite thing, besides every, uh, ditto, 100% back to you. I mean, it's Julie Fleck. We all know how brilliant she is. Mm -hmm. and, but one of my favorite things with you is when we get on a roll, <laughs> when we're breaking a story and we're like, I don't know, what's the thing, the thing? We both will suddenly say the same rando word out of the blue that nobody will have thought of yet. We're like, zombies or whatever yeah. the thing is. So we're like, we got it, we got it. So there's these we moments where we're literally like, our brains are starting to meld and they get there and they get there and it makes me laugh so hard because there's just this, we come at it from this different process and we land in the same place and it's so thrilling and so enjoyable. But also we were shooting in Europe, in Spain, and we shared a flat. <laughs> we were roommates. We were roommates Aww. and we, um, We'd wrap at like four in the morning and we'd come home and we'd drink beer and eat oh, laughing cow cheese. <laughs> and do our like, rewrites. And do all of our little homework little at the end of the day. You know, can wow. you yeah. see somebody breaks an ankle or something? You have to shift some scenes around. <laughs> and you know, that's what you do. <laughs> I appreciate that. <laughs> and like week one, somebody week breaks one, an ankle. Like, and see what happens. <laughs> but it was fun. It was yeah. really, really fun. <laughs> Our next question is for you, Marguerite, uh, oh. and it's from at Loric Book Dragon, and they ask which episode you can't wait for people to see. Ooh. Oh, so this is hard. So hard, you guys. It's really, really hard. This is hard because one of the things I'm the most proud of is that every episode that you watch, the next episode feels like it gets deeper and better and more exciting because we know the characters more and we're more excited by the adventure. So I feel like if if I said it was two, it would be three. And if I said it was three, it would be four and all the way through. So I just feel like I'm, uh, this is a cheesy answer, but I'm kind of excited for them to see the entirety of the series. I'm so excited the cast has finally seen most of it. And I'm like, now you know what you're in, right? <laughs> and they're like, oh my God. Yes. <laughs> so I think that's my answer. I just want people to like love the whole thing. Yeah. yeah. Enjoy it as a whole. <laughs> and for CC at Vampire Academy Bound ask how many TikToks or reels are in the drafts right now from Spain? Oh my God. <laughs> Good. Okay. No, no, no. Actually, let me think about this. Okay. I'm going to say like eight. Um, however, I have a list of about a hundred ideas that I had thought of and that I've been slowly executing. So you will see some crazy, some crazy stuff. I well, just I literally have this image of you I can't based on your, your Instagram. Like I'm like, CC just sits at home at night in like the middle of the night, she can't sleep, she's up. And I'm she's editing. just like working the gram, working the gram. <laughs> yeah, you're good at it. You're right, I mean, you're right. I love that stuff. And like, it's a really good way to connect with the fans as well. Like yeah. all the fan art that we see around us, they, they've already sent us and they've 
tagged us and we get to see it and talk to them. So it's really, really cool. I love Instagram. Social media is an amazing tool. Our next question is for Andre at CeeLo Hino Josa asks, what did they take from the set? What did I take oh. from the set? What did you take from the set? Valuable experience. Valuable yeah. uh -huh. experience. Uh, don't is incriminate this yourself. What is this assumption that I'd be the one to take from the set? Um, <laughs> I mean, it's something. Uh, it's well, okay. Listen, um, we all got our chair backs, which yeah. I think was really nice and we got to take. And obviously I took away all the great memories and friendships. Oh. Oh. But, but what I would like to take from the set. There you go, that's good. Don't keep this on lock, by the way. Uh, <laughs> Maybe the, Chris, Christian's lighter, I think, yeah. would be the best one. Yeah. Yeah. So if that goes missing, we know where yeah. it is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Maybe. Yeah. We all <laughs> some props, but we're not allowed to talk about it yet because it's spoiled. Really? We I stole it. I'm sure we will hear more about the props stolen from set after the show. I'm sure we're we'll. allowed to. <laughs> yeah. Which you can do Julie's going to get on all you. We got an invoice, aren't we, for expenses? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> but this next question is for Kieran <laughs> at VA. Cast Stan account asks, what has been your favorite part about joining the fandom and having a strong fan base? Oh, well, um, firstly, the amazing reception, um, which has been amazing, but also the, um, the passion for something that's so like shared and loved by these people. And we get to, in, we're part of that process now and hopefully there'll be a bond that's even stronger when the show comes out and we can talk about it a little bit more. Mm. Um, but yeah, I'm just hoping that they can be as excited as we are when we made it. Mm. And yeah. yeah. Just quite, I feel, I feel um, very welcome and as a bit of a relative outsider, I kind of like the idea of having a little family with these guys mm -hmm. and hopefully the fans. Mm -hmm. yeah. Aww. We love you. Nice. <laughs> Our next question is for Daniela at Don Pierre Women <laughs> Ask. What was your favorite costume on the show? Okay. Oh, see, Sonia, you had some good costumes. Yeah, Sonia Grande did an amazing job, and she really, I mean, all the outfits that she picked for Lisa were incredible. Mm -hmm. um, but there was this one, like, Valentino dress, like, jacket, sweater thing that was so cute, and she had these little white heels, and I felt like Jackie. It was so <laughs> sweet. And then um, in, like, 9 and, or 10, I think it's 10, I wear this beautiful gown, and I have these, like, sleeves these white like princessy mm. sleeves and a big hoop skirt and uh Ooh. tiara so that one was also like that one's incredible. stunning yeah. stunning unfortunately julie and marguerite have to leave us but before they go can y'all explain to the live stream what a shirgoy is yes <laughs> as a matter of fact we can <laughs> Some qualities of the Strigoi. <laughs> Disloyal, backstabbing. They don't die. They don't die. Strigoi, feral. Feral. Driven by the need unrelenting need to, need to feed. Immortal, very difficult to kill. Violent. Violent, Violent. mean. The nasty vampire, not the hot brooding, no. you know, twelve pack ab vampires. Mm -hmm. Not not big not big fans of the of the Maroi either. They're they're kind yeah. of an enemy yeah, of the Maroi. They're badass. Yeah. yeah. They've lost their souls. They have soulless. Soulless. Good one. Bloodthirsty. Uh, so this definition is very important for the next game. But before we get to that, let's just say a goodbye to Aww. Julie and Marguerite. Bye, guys. We don't get to play the game today. <laughs> Bye, baby. everybody. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Woo. Au revoir. Oh my gosh, it was so cool talking to them. I know. The next game we're playing is called Imposter, where the cast members need to figure out who the Strigoi is at the table. I'm gonna steal Jonetta, Jay August, Andrew, Mia, Rianne, and Anita Joy for this game. If you could all move over to the table and take a seat, you. you'll see six unmarked goblets, and at random, everyone take one to drink from. Right. One of these six goblets contains nasty tasting blood. Everyone's going to take a sip of their liquid and our cast has to try to figure out who is the Strigoi. AKA who has the blood. If you're the Strigoi, you want to try your best to keep a straight face and lie your way through the game so you don't get caught. If you had the good drink, you want to find out who got the bad one, the one with the blood. At the end, everyone will vote to apprehend the rogue Strigoi. The Strigoi wins if they don't get caught, but everyone else wins if they do. It's kind of like Mafia, but with a twist. Is everyone ready? Yes! yes. yes. Take a drink. <laughs> <laughs>
I'm scared. <laughs> You make me feel so on edge immediately. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Cheers. Cheers, cheers. 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 people. Oh. <laughs> Bottoms up. <laughs> I already know who it is. <laughs> oh, poker faces are on. Oh. oh. We have another Mia, come well, on. Mia's girl. just like a classic. <laughs> she's gonna laugh. So <laughs> Oh, is she's failing? I don't know. I don't know. Like I, Marie is playing it real cool. Mm -hmm. yeah, no one's is. pointing at her. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I don't Anita Joy just mm. immediately started pointing. <laughs> <laughs> She's trying to throw everyone mm -hmm. off. Mm -hmm. right, okay, should we spit? Mm -hmm. Alright, everyone, spit. spit it out. Spit. <laughs> That was under the bus, I was trying to say. <laughs> Anita Joy threw everybody under the bus, but I think it was Jojo Dancer. I think it was Jojo Dancer. Yeah. Because, yeah. because her cheeks went, you were <laughs> not happy. She didn't even flinch when okay, I said it was her. It's, it's Jojo. Yeah, so Adam, it's me. Yeah, exactly. exactly. It's you, Jojo. You could say it's me, but it's not me. <laughs> wow. I, I it's think, Jojo. I think, I think if, we, if we roll the tape back, uh huh. Roll tape. You'll see. What are you gonna see? This Mia's reaction. Mia's reaction when she, like, she tasted it from the first time. It really? Wasn't, it wasn't like, that good, good blood. Uh huh. You know what I'm uh -huh. saying? Uh huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, good, I was good. very excited that it wasn't vinegar in my cup. So picture. that's why you yeah. like. <laughs> More for you. Okay. If you All right. Vote. Majority okay. vote, guys. Majority vote. I vote for Joe. Jojo. I don't know. Jojo. Jo I don't vote for Jojo. I'm on this side. I'm gonna vote for Jojo. Oh wow. Three three. I'm not doing that. Oh wait, three versus yeah. three. Yeah. We need a majority. Well, should we? But if the right. three of all them right, vote right. for one person, then it's a tie. Yeah, I was, I was. Pitch again, I'm in why it was Mia. Pitch again, why it was Mia. Yeah, but I'm not off you yet. Oh. Wow. Oh. Wow. Re was pulling a bit oh. of a funny face. Yeah. Yeah, she was. Yeah. That's true. Stoic. Stoic. Yeah. Like, oh, it's not it's me. Mia. Oh, it's it not is me. Mia. I vote for Mia. All right, I'll just, I'll just make it interesting. Okay. All right. We hilarious. all voted for Mia. Absolutely all hilarious. Right. What do you mean? Okay, guys, you're going reveal yourself. Wait, no, I didn't vote. I didn't vote. I'm still up to this. It's not you. It was you. They said reveal yourself. It's Re. No, they just said reveal yourself. She had no. I did no, say she no pointed. Fish, I think we did. She threw no everyone nothing. off. No nothing. Wow. <laughs> I would like my a goodness. <laughs> wow, that was flawless. Oh, oh my god. That was good. That was good. Not I knew I could smell it. I was doing this. Well played. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Good, job. good job. Good job. No, I could yeah. not. All right. You, you guys are you having so much fun. fun. All right. Can I get you all over here to this area? Please. Thank you all so much for playing with us. Oh. If you guys want to, leave a comment down below and let us know how excited you are for this season of Vampire Academy. But up next, it's time to reveal a big surprise. Heck yeah. We have an exclusive clip of the cast giving a set tour and you are the first ones in the world who get to see it. <laughs> We're so excited to share this exclusive clip with you. Get ready for some vampire shenanigans. Without further ado, what we have all been waiting for, here is the never before seen clip from Vampire Academy. Woo! Oh, we're rolling. I'm about to tell you where the real action starts. Let's talk. Let's do it. I can't tell you exactly what you're gonna see because you will see everything. Take one. Action. Hello, I'm Cece Stringer, and I play Rosemary Hathaway on Vampire Academy. And here we are in beautiful Olite, Spain. We're in a Spanish monastery, and we have this beautiful castle, and that serves as our academy. All of our sets have been practical, and so as actors, we get to just sort of jump into this and immerse ourselves in the physicality of it all. We are currently in the monastery, but the set designers came in and built this Maroi dorm hallway for the rich and upper class. Tell them to go easy on the starch. I'm sensitive. I have a feeling that someone's in this room, someone who might like to see me. Oh, ah! <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? I'm Nadia Nunes. I play Lisa. Come on in. <laughs> this is my room. I think it's so colorful to really contrast the, the lifeless barracks. Yeah, that's where I sleep. Swarming it with the rest of us now. Tell us about the unicorns. Christian has a lovely line. 
where he says, Lissa, you really are a unicorn. So naturally, I have 17 unicorns in my bedroom. I don't need a man to save me. Neither do I. It's Andre here. I play Christian Ozera. This is my room. There's a bunch of books. Christian's a big reader. It's old and raw. It really is kind of beautiful. Spain is cool, man. When we first got here, it was a monastery and some fields and a vineyard. And now if you check out the set, it's completely transformed. Yeah, it's just, it's incredible. It's so magical. We see Mia a lot in Victor's house. That's our family home. It's very bougie, very cool. Where else do I spend time? A little bit in the Guardian training barracks. This is where Sonia spends all of her time. The set at night. It's so romantic. All of the candles are lit. This is her place. We are at Elite Castle. This is where we shoot a lot of our royal court scenes. We have an obligation to everyone, not just the Maroi. Obviously, the costumes are super fly. Check this thing out. The minute I put this outfit on and started walking around these locations, I knew exactly who the character was. Behind me, St. Vladimir's Academy. It's just a pretty romantic and special environment. Do you know what you've done? Mind your tone, Victor. This is a sacred place. As you can see, we're at the church, uh, where we filmed some really incredible scenes. I'd sooner die than see your family's bloodline on the throne. Perhaps the saints will grant you your wish. She's got a very great wardrobe. Personal favorite's probably the one that I've got now, because this is the first dress that I wore in the show, which is just so cool. I need a favor. Can you pass Lissa a note for me? <laughs> no way. We're currently in the courtyard for St. Vladimir's, but by far one of my favorite places to be was the Dampier Bar. The whole thing was designed for us, and it's also where we keep our memorials for all of the fallen Dampiers, which I think it's key in the show to remember that it is life or death for these guys. You're kind of a guardian nerd, aren't you? I'm Kieran Moore, playing Dmitry Belikov. I'm about to take you where the real action starts. Yeah. Fight then. This is some cool lights, some cool fights. <laughs> I'm impressed. Ooh, look who it is! I play Mason Ashford. He's um, better than Dimitri. <laughs> he has this undying love for Rose. I'm more comfortable on top. Don't I know it? Easy. It's my girl. These fights are real. There is no special effects. Everything you see has been performed, which is a credit to the amazing stunt team we have here. That's just a little bit of what's going on in the show. This whole experience is once in a lifetime. We have all fell in love with these characters. Yeah, we've built a little family here, man. We've built a little family. You're not gonna use like that. I need you to stop. I'm gonna use all of it. I need you to stop. Unfortunately, that's the end of our show. No. Thank you so much for joining us today. We had a blast playing around with the cast and showrunners of Vampire Academy. Don't forget to watch Vampire Academy streaming now on Peacock. Thank you so 